Hi there guys, Elfie here. Um, I was working with a teacher on Minecraft Edu the other day um, that he knew how to play Minecraft but uh, hadn't used Minecraft Edu before and realised that my tutorials show you what you can do with Minecraft Edu but don't necessarily show you how to do it. So this next sequence of tutorials will hopefully show you how to do some of the stuff in Minecraft Edu. The first thing I'm going to work on um, is long build mode so you press B and you can tick long build mode um, I better give myself something to place and you can see that, that the wireframe block goes a long way away I should be able to place a block up to about 70 oh, there you go so about 70 80 blocks away so you just place blocks like normal um, this is how I've been building my cell, just finding the place I wanted it to, I want it to go to, and then just holding down the right mouse button until it gets close. Um, so that's long build. All it does is enable you to build um, a long distance away. A bit laggy there. Um, so I'm going to turn long build off. Next one I'm going to work on is the place amount. This can go up to 30. Um, for today I'm just going to go with seven, with 15 sorry um, so you press B to get the build menu up select the place amount and make sure you press set so that it comes up down the bottom here place amount set to 15 like that press B to get out and you can now place 15 blocks at, well, I'm going to turn long build on just so I can show you um, place 15 blocks with one click now it, it places 15 blocks in the direction that you are, f are clicking the block from. So if I click here, I'm clicking on the top of the block, so it will place 15 blocks on top of that block. So there you go, 15 blocks on top. If I click here, I'm clicking on this side, so it will put 15 blocks on that side. And so on and so forth. So you can build some pretty cool structures like that. Um, the next tool you have there is undo last place um, so I can undo all of the placings I just did of those and you can see them disappear as I do it um, I'm going to put place amount back to 1 and set dig amount to 15 um, and this does the same thing instead of placing blocks and 15 blocks though it will dig 15 blocks so if I dig here the way I would normally dig so pressing left click instead of right click it will actually dig 15 blocks straight down and like place amount it, it digs in the direction that you click on the block so here if I click on this face of the block here it's going to dig 15 blocks in that direction so there it goes alright um, so I could dig 15 blocks straight through the mountain like so. Alright, so that's the dig amount and place amount tools. Uh, I'll reset that to one. The next is the fill clear tool. Now, uh, I'll leave long build on. This can get a little bit tricky, uh, but let's say I wanted to fill an area with diamond blocks. So I'm going to fill from there, so you can see I just placed a block down and it said first position selected and then I'm going to place the second block down. Interesting, that turned to sand. Um, and that's filled that area for me. You can do that in three dimensional space if you wish, um, but you do need to have horizontal build mode on. Um, now it's a fill and clear tool so to explain to you I'm going to clear this mountain here so what you do to do the clear tool is you uh, right click as if you were placing a block with an empty hand and you'll see first block position selected up down the bottom there and then it will clear that whole lot for you alright so you need an empty hand to do that and of course I can undo that um, with last fill and it will do that and again I can get rid of I'll do it so you can see it that one with with a click as well alright um, what else have we got horizontal build mode if I turn off fill clear you need to have a block selected and you can see that that's putting a wire frame out in front of me so 
that means I can place a block there in midair. Um, so what this allows you to do is you can also delete it. Um, but if you combine that with the fill clear tool, you can actually in three dimensional space fill a whole area with blocks. So that will fill that whole area with blocks. Um, all using right clicks to place. Um, and of course if you wanted to clear an area, you probably wouldn't want to clear an area in midair with horizontal build mode, but you could do it if you wanted. I think that's pretty much it for the build tools um, and the tutorial today, so thanks for taking the time to watch. I hope this clarifies a little bit how to do things instead of just showing you what you can do. Thanks again for watching, like and subscribe, and see you later.